Warning, this video may disturb or trigger some people. Viewer discretion is highly advised. I'm down at my mum's house and there seems to be an injured uh, lorikeet here. I don't know whether it's been attacked by something else or hit by a car or something. I've got a bit of food here, maybe we'll take a nibble of this. Come on, gonna have a bit of, oh yes. It's gonna have a bit of a feed. Maybe you can see a bit clearer what's going on there. I think the poor thing, it's in a very bad way. Oh, it's quite sad, isn't it? I don't know what to do here. Normally these birds are in pairs. They sort of stay in mated pairs. And I can't see another bird around, or I can't see one hanging around with it. Who knows, it might just be old age that has got this one here. Yes, it's very, very hungry. I can get up very close to this bird. It's um, something going on with the eye there. I don't like the look of that at all. It's, it's sort of bulging out the side of the head there. They say there'll be experts in my audience who's going to identify what's going on here. Come on, how do you, how do you whisper, bird whisper to one of these things? Beep, beep, beep. Beep, 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 beep. Oh, I think it did a bit of a sneeze then. Um, it tends to tuck its head in behind its, its wings uh, when it's just sort of being left alone. Poor thing, hey? There's a bit of a look at the wing area there. There's something going on. Oh, it's going to have a bit of a bite of me, I think. Going to be nasty and bite me or not? No, it's too sick, I think. They're beautiful things, aren't they? Absolutely stunning birds. There's something going on here at the back here. Come on, you're okay. Come on. Oh, I heard a bit, but that's okay. There you go. Have a feed. I'll keep an eye on this bird here. Uh, to be honest here, I don't think it's got much life left in it. From what I can see going on. Little bird is pulling at my heartstrings. I've got one of their favourite biscuits. That's like a Scotch finger biscuit. No ad for Arnott's, unfortunately. And we'll uh, see how the bird responds to this one here. Oh yeah, tucking into that one nice and sweet, hey? Nice and sweet. And I'll leave that down there for him or her. So someone can sex the bird for me because I can't. It's going to nibble away at that. Hopefully no other bird will come along and take it away from him or her. I'll do a bonus extra here on the birds. I've got some pelicans here. Ooh, hello. Hello, Mr. Pelican. Its beak can hold more than its belly can. That's why they're called pelicans. Pretty cool, aren't they? I wonder if they bite, eh? I'm not even going to try and find out. Very, very cool looking birds, these things. Hanging around the fish markets and I dare say they get plenty of free food here. Massive birds, completely huge. That pecker is just at the right height, isn't it, hey? Hey, let's feature another bird in this uh, bird exotic video here. Now these birds, uh, I classify them as Pokemon Go birds because if you're playing Pokemon Go, that's the sort of critters you're catching. And the trick to uh, looking at birds is if you keep still, they actually forget that you're here and I can get some nice video of these guys pecking through the rubbish. Look at that, perfectly adapted beaks for pecking through rubbish bins, eh? And snapping at your friends and making funny sounds. And some seagulls in the background. Oh, yeah, I can stand here and watch these guys all day, it's a great free show. No, except for the smell. Uh, the smell's not good because that's the fish market bin. But hey, that's what those guys love. Well, those birds will survive the next zombie holocaust, I'm sure about it. Look at the way that they can find food. You don't see zombies doing that. There's one right here having a good hard look at me. That guy there. As long as I don't move too much, he doesn't know I'm here. Thank goodness YouTube doesn't have smell of vision or else you'd be uh, moving away from this video real fast. There's a nice shot of its bum as well. So there you go, what else do you want in life? A bunch of birds picking through rubbish, a pelican with a giant beak, which is bigger than its belly can, and a sick bird at my mum's place. Oh, I don't know, I couldn't add any more in this video to make it more epic, could I? Oh, apart from that bird attacking me. Ooh, we just had some action here. A couple of very bad, bad people. Oh, 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 oh. Getting handcuffed, naughty boy. Well, there is a very different style of pelican. Uh, those two pelicans there have been bad pelicans. 
and the long arm of the law has caught up with those pelicans. Yes, as always, crime doesn't pay. I know you'll be wondering what happened to the beautiful lorikeet you saw in this video that was injured. I went back to my mum's house the next day. I couldn't find the bird. I was going to try and give it another Arnott's Scotch Finger Biscuit. What I highly suspect is overnight the cats in the neighbourhood have come along and had this bird as a meal. Sadly, if you're a bird and you can't fly, it won't be long until you're someone's meal. And this is a reminder that nature can be so, so cruel.